welcome back to Deadly Outlaws 5 Star Review. Outlaws, welcome back to Deadly Outlaws 5 Star Reviews. This is part one of the Subway series just for this week because I'm on vacation and I won't be back for a couple more weeks. If you saw the community tab, there'll be no live streams until the 21st or 22nd of September. All right, Outlaws, so I'm here at Subway to try their new smoke brisket. A quick thumbnail of this. Thumbnail. Look at that, Outlaws. The smoked cheddar brisket. This is new from Subway. Look at that. There's that brisket right there. Look at that. Oh, oh, oh. Looks good. There's barbecue sauce, cheddar cheese. That's and barbecue and, and, and that's all it's supposed to be on it on a wheat bread. But I decided to put you know vegetables on there because I gotta eat healthy too. You know. All right, I can't wait to try this. Let's give this a try. But before we get to that, if this is your first time checking out this video and I'm making you hungry, consider subscribing my channel to have great food content I upload on Mondays, Wednesdays, and regular Fridays, sweet and drink reviews price. With this upcoming Friday, unless Joey has plans, he has to reschedule, I will be doing a collaboration with Joey. Just in case anything changes, I do have another video that's up there for Friday in case there's any issues. So, but if not, and we do it, I'll move the video for next week. All right, let's give this smoked cheddar brisket a try. Mmm. A little bit burnt on the um, brisket right here. See when you see it right here. It's smoky. Yeah, a little bit burnt. Yeah, let's get a little piece of this right here. Here it is. It's uh, the cheese is melted nicely. There's one right here. A little tough and chewy on the um the brisket. I don't know if this is maybe a day old bread or so, I'm not sure, as it's really hard on this bread. Oh yeah, smoky flavor with the barbecue sauce. Tangy, probably sweet baby raisin, I'm assuming it's barbecue sauce. And of course the vegetables are crisp. Juicy, uh, the tomato's kind of ripe on here. Yeah, yuck. It's kind of ripe. Not good. All right, so what do I give us on my rating? On Outlaw's rating, to me, this is okay. It's not the best sandwich I've had before. Come on, Subway, you did good on your ciabatta sandwiches. I liked your chicken pesto. I'm going to take a diet cook with this. On Outlaw's rating, I'm going to give this, I'm going to give it a 3 out of 5. It's okay. It's not the best. Like I said, the meat was on here tough. 
and chewy, of course, which is good, but it's really tough on lots of parts of it on the brisket. And the bread really here is really hard. It almost feels like day old bread, in my opinion. Even though they toast it, it feels like day old bread. And the, you know, the, the tomato is very ripe, not good at all. The, the, most of the vegetables are crisp with the lettuce and the, not just the vegetables are crisp, but just the tomato failed or so. A three out of five, it's okay. I guess guys, why don't you try to go to Subway and try their new smoked cheddar brisket. Maybe you'll have a better one than me. I know I look pretty busy at Subway today. Um, but um, this, that's a, a three out of five. All right, so yeah, you guys see I'm doing two videos for you guys when I'm on vacation. So I'm gonna be showing you part two soon where I'm gonna review the sliders. So I can say a three out of five. Okay, not too bad for Subway, but like I said, Chipotle sandwiches are a win-win situation. All right! So I have some other videos here. Click on my Chibata sandwiches right in their collection. And a mukbang, click on that video right here. Click to round subscribe on your wrestling news, brother. Click to round subscribe on Atlas Generation. That's it for the review. You can't review it until you taste it. And next time, you can come hang out with me in next food adventure. And I'll show you more delicious foods that you should try. Fellas! Outlaws Generation out.